welcome back to my channel. My name is Johanna, and for those of you who are new here, welcome. And for those of you who are returning, welcome back. Here on my channel, I do planner and planner-related videos, DIY tutorials, budget videos, and the occasional new release video of items that I've listed to my Etsy shop. And if that is of interest to you, please consider subscribing to my channel. And if you hit that little notification bell, you'll always be notified of when I do load a new video. And if you could also comment, like, and share, that would be truly appreciated. So it is a work night. Should I be filming? No. Am I filming? Yes. And I'm hoping this will be a short video because we're just going to be doing the September monthly setup for the social media and business section of my DIY Happy Planner Happy Nietzsche. Um, and I've actually already put the calendar together. That's why this is here. I saw Andy um, who saw... I'm not sure, maybe it was Takoa or it could have been uh, Tamara, but they used the monthly from their mini, which I had, and then they just cut it down to fit. So that's what I've done here. I actually, I believe I have a monthly through the end of the year. And while I don't know that I'll buy another mini uh, specifically for the monthly calendar, I, I kind of like the idea. And then for all of these, um, pages that I will not be using. I actually have an idea of how I can use that for uh, another purpose, but that's for another time. Now in my monthly overview, I generally don't use one, but I like to use one in the social media and business section because then I can map out uh, what my what I want my projected task to be for that month. And so I've already color coded it. And then either later on today or maybe tomorrow during my lunch break, I'll actually fill this in because September is actually going to be kind of a, a busy month for me from a video and blogging standpoint. This actually is only for the video and the blog. It doesn't track anything that I'm doing for my Etsy shop, Pinterest, or, or that stuff. So really, um, we're going to find something for this space right here, and then we're going to focus on this section right here. Now, I have an idea of how I want this to go. Oh, that goes there. And it's going to start with some hand lettering. Now, if you've been watching the hand lettering series from a beginner, uh, this may not be the greatest idea because there's some letters that I'm not actually really sure how to do yet. But, you know, other than this moment right here, you guys aren't going to see this. So what, why not? Why not? play and have some fun and the thing is I've already committed to the calendar so I I mean worst case scenario I guess I can just <laughs> cover this up so I'm gonna write in September oh guys I'm nervous I'm mean, nervous it's just some paper and a pen all right so thick and then thick <laughs> and then thin yeah, I, I'm not actually up to the S's in my hand lettering journey. <laughs> Let's do some swirlies just to make it look cute. And then E thick and come up. Oh. Sem. Oh my god, guys. So focused on the letters, I'm not focused on the spelling. September. You know what? We're gonna go with it. <laughs> I know what it means. You know what it means. Sem. Because I don't know that I can fix that. I can guess I could. You know what September is gonna be? September. <laughs> it's good because the T's easy to do. <laughs> So, T, Sim, connect those, and how do they come up? I think that's supposed to go like that. to the E. <laughs> oh, this is excruciating. 
rotating. And then I guess it goes up and then down. Semtemper. I dub thee. <laughs> Can't believe I just did that. Coo, coo, coo. All right, so let's just see. And it's, I'm like, do I press hard? Do I press thin? Doesn't matter if it's a number. It does not. I mean, it does. I should be consistent, but yeah. Oh, and it's covered, so we're good. <laughs> That's going to go on Instagram just like that. <laughs> okay, sweet. So for the actual um, artwork, I was looking through my sticker books, and I didn't really see anything. Well, well I saw lots of things. But I think I'm just going to freehand something very simple. I mean, it can't be any worse than September. Well, I mean, that's not a challenge. I'm not <laughs> throwing down on the mistake gods to say, hey, how worse can this get? Mm. <laughs> not a challenge, guys. Not a challenge. Just going to make big loop-de-loops. Don't really need to be consistent. Just want it to be a very loose flower. Oh, I think that looks actually kind of sweet. And then, and then let's be kind of extra and make it look like some has fallen. I actually want to do some more. Make this really full. Oh, I'm hoping you guys can see this. I think that looks really nice and then here we'll do some smaller ones and we'll just kind of do the same and I I think we can bring in a touch of pink to these and then I can use some black on here to accent. I think that would look really nice. And I've mentioned this, I'm not sure in what video, could have been several. Uh, more and more this is becoming more of a bullet journal to me than a happy Nietzsche. I mean, it's, I still call it a happy Nietzsche. It's just, um, I rarely do the Hobonichi inspired layout, um, which I think a happy Nietzsche was originally geared towards. So I like the aspect of being able to play and just be kind of loosey goosey with my layouts. And if I want to, um, I can always go back to the Hobonichi inspired layout, but I really like how this is turning out. And we'll do, no, we're gonna leave that as is. And then we'll bring in some black. Oh, that looks nice. I mean, the word is totally misspelled. <laughs> but it still looks nice. Well, nice as a beginner who's been doing this for weeks <laughs> can make it look. <laughs> oh, I'm liking that. That's, that's, that's good. Yeah. And then... 
I really should be more consistent if I'm doing the inside or the outside, but I mean, really, you're gonna be focusing that the P is missing. <laughs> and then we'll bring in some pink with our little center here. I should make some leaves. No. No, I kind of like it like that. All right, and this goes here. Where'd my other page go? And I'm thinking maybe I should just keep with the theme of the simple flowers and not use any stickers at all. I don't know how much value you guys are going to find in this. I mean, cause it is rather simple, simply put together, but let me put one here in the corner and maybe we can find a quote to go with. I think even without the pop of pink, I, I, I kind of like the, the black and white aspect. Now the actual layouts on a weekly basis will still be pretty colorful, but I, I do love the simplicity of this. And I think you could color in, I think you could do multiple colors. I don't like that that one's not. Now let's see. Um, but I mean, I think it's it's versatile and it's really simple to do. Very easy to recreate. Mm. So we can find just a little tiny quote sticker for here. This is the Choose Happy in the Mini. So from a size perspective, I, I think we might have some luck. She says as she's not seeing anything really small. <laughs> of course not. Um, not the color I want. Do all the things. Oh, those are really pretty. I'm gonna have to use those in something. Since I don't plan in my mini, I actually don't come in here um, in my mini sticker books very much, but clearly I need to because they're really cute. Life is a journey, enjoy the ride. It's kind of big though. I like beautiful minds inspire others, but not the coloring. Well, there's not, there's no days there. Smile big, laugh big, let's do Again, not the same color, not the color I want. We'll do Smile Big for September. <laughs> yep, that's what happens when you plan at nine o'clock at night on a work night. All right, so guys, look, we did a thing. <laughs> we really did a thing. Oh, I still have that open. Maybe we can do something. I don't want this to look like a spider. Maybe I should do more just circles. That look like a spider, a smushed spider. All right, now we've got to fix it. We can fix it, guys. We've got a million sticker books. <laughs> Everything is fixable with sticker books. Those hearts are clear. Can I get a solid heart? I just said you could help fix this. Don't make me a liar, sticker book. You're making me a liar sticker book. <laughs> All right. 
I'll pull some hearts. That, that did nothing. That did absolutely nothing. We were okay, and then we veered, and then we were okay, and then we veered. <laughs> we're gonna small wave, and we're gonna live big. Because if you can't be right, be big. <laughs> Look, fixed. All right, let me outline it. Hopefully I don't go in the sticker. And I like doing that when it's white on white because then it pops more. All right, guys, let me know what you think of this. I mean, again, this should be a relatively short video. I think that actually looks really sweet, very simple. This is hilarious to me. It's hilarious. And that will go on Instagram just like that. And then this again, this is gonna be more functional than decorative. I think we still brought in a pop of color and some decorations. <laughs> Oh, happy September to you. And as always, aloha.